Jackson, why aren't you working on that test? Are you asking me to fail you and give you a zero, especially during your junior year of high school? Mr. Teacher, I told you, I don't want to take this goddamn test because I was lazy and I didn't want to waste my time to study. Just please do it now Jackson, just give it a try, your lack of business in school is not my responsibility. No, I am not doing this fucking test. Yes you are, work on that writing test right now. No. Go fuck the shit to yourself. If you don't put your pencil on that paper, then you will have to work on it after school. Oh you better let me out of here. Oh fine, have it your way, you will be staying in my classroom for detention doing your test while everyone goes home for the day. I am gonna write your name on the board. Oh sure go ahead, I don't give a fuck. Oh you better care, get writing now or the writing stays on the wall. Alright that is the bell, you all are dismissed except Jackson, have a good day everyone. Oh boy, someone is in trouble this time. Now Jackson, you are gonna sit here and do this test, if you finish it, just maybe, I will let you go ahead and walk back home to your mobile home. Worst in some cases, I can give you a free period. Like I said, I don't wanna take this stupid quiz. And that is final Mr. Teacher. Then you will be in here every day in the afternoons after school until you finish that test. How about that? Holy shit. God 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 no. Exactly. Now, I am going down to the teacher's lounge for a cup of hot tea. If you do anything else than other than doing something worse or thinking about failing and cheating the test, I will be the first to know. This is fucking ridiculous. I am forced here to take this dumb test, and already I'm starving, have not eaten all day because no one gave me their lunch money. There has got to be some food I can hoard onto here. Oh, I'm wondering. Maybe the teacher has some secret stash. Oh, nothing so far. Oh wait, jackpot for hell yeah. Wow, I could totally use a hot dog with hot Doritos and a Mountain Dew from 7-Eleven right now. This might be the teacher's wallet, but not any more for that loser. I have all the money, just like taking candy from a baby or more like, taking money from the teacher and students. Ha 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 ha. Busted. There is no lying now, I have all the evidence I need. Give me my wallet right now. I am very furious, how did you get a hold of my wallet? Uh, maybe some other student or maybe Carney had your bag sitting out in the open. Carney did nothing. I'm calling the principal, and I am calling the police. No 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 Hello Principal Thurman, I need you to come to my classroom immediately. I have caught one of my students stealing my wallet. Can you come up here? Okay perfect, see you soon. Operator please get me the police. Hello, I need some police to come to Los Angeles High School and come to room 200 on the first floor. I just caught a student stealing my wallet from my bag. Yeah thanks, goodbye. Once again, you have been caught causing the worst trouble out there along with bullying. You know more worse consequences than getting suspended. What happened, mister? I was on my way back to my classroom, and I caught this student snooping through my bag and stealing my wallet. Luckily, I stopped him before I could try and see him do something terrible like the student always does. There was over $500 in there. Young man, you know Larson is a felony? Looks like you are gonna go to jail for a very very long time. I have already called his parents. Just get him out of here, and Jackson, you are suspended. Put your hands behind your back, you gangbanger. We are taking you to jail. Jackson, I cannot believe you stole your teacher's wallet and got arrested and got charged with a felony. When you get home from jail, you will be grounded for quadruple years. <laughs>